Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Purudhavan and today in this video, I am going to talk about a very serious issue of fluid accumulation in the lungs found in some kidney failure patients. Also, we will be asking some important questions like what factors give rise to this situation and what are the treatment approaches to get rid of this. We will discuss all these things today. To begin with, if there are any kidney failure patient in your non-contact, then you may have noticed that some of these might be going through leg swelling problem. But what's the reason behind this? Maybe some of you know this already, but still to help you out, I will explain you guys. Our kidney perform the vital function of filtering out the waste out of the body. But in a CKD patient, this process is not completed properly. As a result, the fluid get collected in their body, especially in the legs, causing the problem of leg swelling. So how is this leg swelling a matter of concern for kidney failure patient? Let's understand this. When the patient is walking or sitting, generally no problem occurs. But while laying down on the bed or while asleep, the fluid flows horizontally from the swollen foot and gets filled up in the lungs of the patient. Now, when this happens, the swelling of the legs become reduced remarkably as the fluid is getting removed from the legs for a temporary time period. But this creates a big issue for the lungs. As the fluid has collected in the lungs, the patient feels uneasy, suffocated and find difficulty in breathing. Patient find too much problem while taking rest or while sleeping and this further caused many other health issues. As a result, the patient has to get up and sit eventually so that the fluid flows out of the lungs in the downward direction and gives them a feeling of relaxation. So till now, I have discussed about the swelling problem found in some of the kidney patients, which can be a life threatening issue if not treated on time. But what is the solution for this? Are there temporary solution only or any permanent cure also available? So first I will tell you about some solutions which are easy to do and which can be used for instant relief from the fluid filled lungs. First, reduce the quantity of water and salt intake. Second, prioritize the diuretic prescribed by your doctors as this will increase the excretion of urine and reduce fluid quantity in the patient's body. Third, while sleeping or laying down on bed, use triangle shaped pillow as shown here on the screen. This is a very useful math for temporary relief. Doing this prevents the water to flow upward towards the lungs, which helps the patient in having a sound sleep. See, it is very important to get a proper treatment for this problem, which actually helps in a long run. Because if this problem of fluid accumulation reaches advanced stage, then it becomes too late. It becomes difficult for the doctor too. At that time, what to focus upon the kidney or the lung suppose the kidney get damaged but even then also the person can manage somehow by getting a dialysis but if the lung become damaged then there is no cure for it except taking the support of ventilator as lungs are must for a person to breathe now to manage this problem properly you have to check your reports and find out the amount of protein and albumin present in your body if you find the amount of protein or albumin is low in your body, then it's very necessary to manage this problem. So to treat this, increase the intake of protein in your daily diet through protein rich, kidney friendly foods like tofu, lentils, legumes and so on. All these steps which I discussed and mentioned above will surely help you to treat lungs of a kidney failure patient. So this was all in today's video. I hope you have understood the importance of lungs. How can the fluid collection be dangerous and what are the different type of treatment available for this problem? Still, if you have any doubt, you may contact with us or you may also share your queries in the comment section below. See you guys in the next video. Till then, tata, bye bye and namaste.